Hey guys, Nikhil here from Home Banao. In this video, I'll talk about different costs which you will have after you complete purchasing a home apartment. Uh, this would be cost which go into flooring, furnishing, painting, plumbing, adding basic amenities to your house and essentially converting your house from a concrete block to a livable house. This video does not cover government fees, tax rates and all those things. We are talking about after you complete these formalities and purchases, what will be the additional spend you'll have on making the house livable. Now for the purpose of this video, I have assumed a thousand square feet house and considered a city like Bangalore, Delhi, Mumbai, etc. Before I get into this video, I would like you to comment below and let me know what you think is going to be the approximate estimate to make a, a house from a concrete block to something livable. Assuming it's a thousand square feet house, let's see if you were right or wrong. So comment below and by the end of it, let's see how close you were to the estimate. So let's get started. Now for this video, I've broken down the costs into four major categories. First is basic amenities. What I mean by that is flooring, painting, electrical, etc. Next, we'll get into things like furniture. So furniture would be your bed, sofas, etc. Third would be your interior designer cost, meaning the additional cost you'll spend on hiring an interior designer and some additional elements you'll add because you've hired an interior designer. And finally, we'll talk about different appliances, which you'll end up purchasing to make your day-to-day -day living in the house easier. So let's get into the first one, which is basic amenities. So this involves flooring, painting, plumbing, electrical. Typically, the house which you get from your builder has these things however you have to keep in mind they are not using great material and they are indirectly charging you for it so more often than not you will end up redoing it or spending a little bit more to make sure that it is fine so you may spend more on basic things like taps on switch ports on wires on fans and typically for a house of thousand square feet it would cost you about 6.5 to 10.5 lakhs Next, let's get into furniture. This involves your sofa set, your bed, your kitchen, kitchen cabinets, wardrobes, etc. For a thousand square feet house, it comes to about 3.5 to 4.5 lakhs, depending on different materials, laminates, finishes which you use. Third, we'll get into hiring an interior designer and additional decor with decor which you'll spend on. So things like your puja room and all. Typically, an interior designer comes for about 50 rupees to 150 rupees per square feet. The thing is they indirectly make a lot more money on commissions from their trusted suppliers. So keep that in mind. So the real cost would be about 3.5 to 4.5 lakhs and an additional 50,000 to 1 lakh for decor and uh, some art pieces, etc. And finally, coming to appliances. So this involves your TV, fridge, geyser, various different uh, electronics. And this would cost about 2 to 2.5 lakhs taking a conservative number i'm assuming of course that you don't already pre-own these things so after you purchase your house and pay the government fees and pay the agent brokerage when you put all these other factors together you're spending an additional 14 to 20 lakhs on your house so please keep this in mind before you do end up deciding to purchase a house because it's not just the advertised real estate price you have to make it livable even if you're planning to rent out this house in the future no one's going to come for rent unless you have these basic amenities in the house so keep this in mind now before the video had started i asked you to comment what was the what was the estimate which you thought to make a thousand square feet concrete block livable so did you get it right did you get it wrong Comment below, let's see, we'll be in the comment section checking out all your comments. All these breakdowns which I have done, I have given a Excel sheet in the description. You can download it. And the best part is I've kept it easy to tweak and change so that you can come up with your own budget. So please download it and let us know if you have any feedback for the video. Hope you like the video. Smash the like button and please subscribe for more future content like this. Thanks.